Hi guys, it's Kerry and today I'm going to be filming my nighttime skincare routine for a Friday just because it's a lot different to what I do in the morning and throughout the rest of the week too. Um, if you would like to see my pamper routine that I do <coughs> every other Sunday, please give this a like. If you enjoy this video, subscribe and comment down below what you would like to see next. So let's get on to the video. So the first thing I do is I brush my teeth and <coughs> I wouldn't, wasn't going to include this but there is one thing I do at the end which does go into my skincare routine so that's why I'm including it. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and brush my teeth. brushing my teeth um, I go ahead and I brush my lips I do that for about 10 seconds of that next I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of my eye makeup and my eyebrows I don't do this to the rest of my face just because it comes off easily with the rest of the stuff it's just my eyes and eyebrows I'm looking funny, it's because I'm going to be using the actual camera to use as a mirror. So I just take this much and I rub it onto my eye. I'm not doing much because I haven't got much makeup on. My eyebrows will do a little bit more. So yeah. I'm going to do the rest of it and then I'll come back. As you can see, I am using the Body Shop Chamomile um, Sumptuous Cleansing Butter. Because I'm filming this on my phone, it might read it backwards. So I thought I'd just read it out. This is really good, but it is a little bit expensive for a makeup remover. Um, I don't use the same makeup remover all the time. It's something that I just use any just because all of them pretty much work for me because I only use them for my eyes and my eyebrows anyway so I'm going to rinse this off and then I'll be back with the next step which I do twice a week now I've just, just taken it off I'm going to be getting my skin so that it's not too dry but it's not too wet because the next thing I'm going to be using is the Body Shop Vitamin C Glow Revealing Liquid Peel. Um, the Body Shop is all cruelty free and stuff like that and I will link the website below if you would like to go and check out anything. Um, the same as some of the other stuff, if I can find the links to them I'll go and check them out. The toothpaste I didn't um, say before is the Beverly Hills Formula Charcoal Toothpaste um, in the flavour Double Mint. And it says white teeth in one minute and I've been using that for a while now and I've always liked using alcohol based toothpastes so yeah um, I'm going to be putting some of this into the palm of my hand I only do one squirt so I do one squirt looks like that and I have to work with this quickly um, because it's like I don't know whether you can see all the little bits, but it's supposed to help. If I'm looking over there too, it's because I'm looking at the mirror to make sure I'm getting the right places. Yeah, again, I'm going to rinse this off quickly. I don't, I'm not showing myself rinsing it off on camera because I take forever to do it. Next, I'm going to be using my face wash because that wouldn't have got all of the makeup off and properly cleansed my skin. As some people would say, I'm going to double cleanse with the Tea Tree Daily Use Cleansing Foam Face Wash, which you can get for 89p in Home Bargains, so it's not too bad. And it is actually a pretty good, um, it's a pretty good face wash. Um, it does say to apply one or two pumps, but because of how my face is, I I'm going to do better with one. So, just like that. 
Yeah, I'm just applying this. Now I'm applying anything, I'm not worried about it. Rinse it off, come back to you, and we're going to get onto all the moisturising stuff there. It's what I do to clean my face. I'm now going to get onto what I do to moisturise my face. First step, step to moisturising my face is toning my face. Um, I've been on and off with different um, toners at the moment. Um, there's one from Asda, which is the kind and I think it's the kind and gentle toner. Um, I do have it upstairs, but since I'm in the downstairs bathroom, I'm not going to go and get it. The one I have, have, however, been using is again a body shop, body shop product, and it is the Aloe Calming Toner, which I find has been great for redness because as you can see my cheeks and my nose all come out in redness and whenever I do break out, excuse that, that's just got a mind of its own, but whenever I do break out I'm having a bit of a bad skin day, um, it all goes red and I find this has helped a little bit to, as it says, calm it down. Um, a tip I had found from a fellow YouTuber had said had shown me a shown a hack to her subscribers um, instead of using your toner on a cotton pad put it in your hand because it concentrates more onto your face and you're not wasting product it just goes straight into your face as well so I literally just pat it in And then make sure it's around all of my face. That's the toner. Next, I'm going to be using the Body Shop Drops of Light. They do say on the website it's to moisturise your face, um, but also it is kind of like a brightening thing. Like underneath my eyes before I started using this, it's so dark, and I really didn't like it. Sorry, really, I've got a bit of mascara in my eye. But yeah. It also helps to add extra moisture in, which my moisturiser is oil based so it makes me really oily after I've used it. So I like to use this to help keep the moisture in instead of it just sliding around my face. I don't use this every morning just because I've got other things that I put on before I do my makeup, um, which will be in next week's video. Um, I have a lot of things I put on before my makeup. I say a lot, a couple of things. I put a lot, a couple of things on before my makeup, which help keeps the moisture in whilst my makeup is sitting on my skin. So I'm just going to be using this again in my hands. I use my hands for everything. I don't use any other tool. The only thing I will be using eventually is I'm going to be using a cleansing brush on my face. Um, if you have any good affordable brands, please link them down below. The best one that I've seen so far is in one of my favourite subscribers' videos. It's the Primark one, but I don't know if there's a Primark still selling it. Um, so please, if you see the Primark one, please let me know. Or if you have any good suggestions, then again, please let me get know. Again, I just put this on like this. I would like to know what kind of videos you want to see because I don't want this just to be my channel. I want it to be my and my subscribers' channel. So, if you do have any suggestions, please don't hesitate to leave them below. At the moment, I am a little bit limited for what I can do with the uh, since I only have my phone. I don't have any cameras or proper lighting yet because I'm only just starting out. So yeah, if you have any videos, please leave them below. I have a few different beauty videos coming up, but yeah, please let me know anything that you would like to see because I don't want it just to be. Ready. Next is the most important step of this routine. It is my moisturiser. Now, my boyfriend's nan had 
to moisturise and send to her for um, his granddad. But because he can't use it, she gave it to my boyfriend. And my boyfriend used it once and he reacted to it in a, a little bit and he just didn't like it. So I used it on my face and it has helped my dryness. Because before I started using this, I had terribly dry skin. Now I have a little bit oily skin, but it just makes me sweat on my top lip and on my nose. It's nothing major, but it is the Ovel Family Apothecary Emulsifying Ointment BP Emollient Moisturiser. It is, I believe it's £5.99 to buy online. Because I didn't buy this, I don't actually know myself, but it, it comes pretty much full to the top. It is a 500 milliliter. No, it's a 500 gram tub. So it, I've been using this for a couple of weeks now, and my skin has definitely improved. So yes, I just try and warm it up because it is like a solid, and I focus here because this is where I get dry the most. Yeah. And then I just grab a little bit to try and moisturise the rest of my skin. I don't do anything to my spots because this is a medication based moisturiser. It basically does it for me. And I can't believe that we're actually down to the last step already. Um, I love my skincare routine because it has helped me so many ways and the last thing I have to do is moisturise my lips because after I brushed them and exfoliated them they've lost the moisture they need so I'm just going to pop a bit of moisturiser on. It is the Dermatech Solutions V10 Strawberry Flavoured Lip Balm. It just looks like this, it comes in a pack of three, you get two original and one strawberry. So yeah, that's all of my products. I will be doing an in-depth pamper routine when I'm using a pamper routine and makeup video soon. So you'll see a little bit more skincare in that. But in my pamper routine, it won't just be for my face, it'll be for my whole body. Since we have come, come to that part of the video where I have to say goodbye basically, I know it's sad, but I do hope that you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you didn't enjoy it, don't put a thumbs up, it's up to you, I'm not fussed. Um, I, like I said, I do want to give back to you, so if you have any kind of video ideas, please let me know, it'll help me a lot and since because I'm starting up I've got a few videos planned for the next couple of months I have a few holiday themed plans coming up but obviously I've got a few I've got a few weeks and months before um, Halloween and Christmas and Easter and stuff like that so yeah if you please be sure to subscribe and I will see you in next week's video. Bye.